Look, don't ask me no stupid question. You hear what you say? I sit down here, I vex, vex, vex. Don't ask no stupid question. Yes. I know combined islands win. You don't have to say that. I know Trinidad Galix. You should ask Auntie Mole about that. She will tell you. Look, I know we've been through all this thing already. But never me again. Never, 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 never me to take no relative with me to the Oval. I'm saying it now and I'm saying it again. No relative with me to the Oval. When I go in the Oval, it's me alone and God going. What? Why I vex? you find I look vex. You didn't study that when you asked me to take Tanti Mall to the Oval. <laughs> eh? I mean to say, my God, I know Tanti Mall from St. Vincent. I know it's she birthday. I know she back in Combined Islands. But why is today of all days you want me to take Tanti Mall to the Oval? Big day like this. Big match going on. Trinidad versus the Combined Islands. You want me to take Tanti Mall to the Oval and Tanti Mall is 65 years old. <laughs> I mean, you have radio. You have television. You have transistor. Tanti Mall could have sit down right here in the house and enjoy the match. But instead of that, you make me drag the woman from Curep straight down to the Oval. Woman, you don't know how you nearly lose a husband? <laughs> eh? Let me tell you about this woman you're calling Tanti Mall. First of all, I tell Tanti Mall, we're leaving 10 o'clock. Match starting 11. We have one hour to reach the Oval. Tanti Mall wouldn't leave the house. She only packing basket. Say nobody gonna starve she in Port of Spain. <laughs> I tell Tanti Mall that Port of Spain have plenty food, but not she. She only titty vain, packing a basket with ginger beer and sorrel and cake and a set of things. And you know who have to carry it? <laughs> Me, a man like me, who like to go in the Oval with me pity court in me back pocket, me money in me side pocket, and me two hands swinging free. See me now with a basket looking like a vendor. People only asking me, what you selling? And that wasn't all. The taxi, and you know how taxi hard to get in QEP. Every taxi has stopped for Tanti Merle. She not going in that. Either the taxi driver look like a crook, or them passengers look too low class, or she ain't sure if the car in show. So she not going in that. So tell Tanti Merle, choose your own taxi. She says she want a red taxi. Now tell me what Tanti Merle want a red taxi for? You see that woman? I think she work in OBI you now. <laughs> Anyhow, I tell Tanti Merle, take your taxi. And you know how the woman do that? She just step off the pavement and say, stop. <laughs> well, you could imagine brakes. I never hear a taxi man cuss so in all my life. But Tanti Merlin take he on. She open the door, she take over the back seat like the Queen of Sheba, and me in going with she smelling like a snacket. <laughs> Next thing she tell the taxi driver, no music. He been playing reggae. She say, no music. We want cricket. Taxi man put on cricket. Well, I didn't mind that too much. But Tanti Merlin start off, combined islands batting. That's we boys, we gonna bust the tail. So the taxi driver turned around and asked she, where you come from? <laughs> well, who tell he say that? <laughs> we get the whole history of St. Vincent. <laughs> How it called Hiruna and a whole set of things. Would I never see a taxi man drive so fast yet? <laughs> First, he want to get Tanti Merle out of the taxi. We drive straight to the Oval. Straight, non-stop, he <laughs> pick up no passengers. Straight to the Oval and put us there. Next thing, Tanti Merle take out a parasol. I 
are not only ordinary parasols, a pink parasol. <laughs> now tell me, what Tanti Merle doing with a pink parasol and is not even carnival? <laughs> she say that nobody gonna kill she with sunstroke. And the next thing, she opened it and tried to go through the oval gate. <laughs> well, you self know the oval gate. Tanti Merle would not close it. Sun mustn't hit she. And you know the oval man and them don't look in people's face. It's only their hand on the money on the ticket, their hand on the money on the ticket. They ain't even know who passed them. But they had to look at Tanti Merle. <laughs> because she nearly juked out the eye. I sign myself when we reach inside that oval and hear what the gate man tell me. If my wife freed son, why I bring she in the oval? Now here say aunt or grandmother. He say wife. So imagine how I feel when I reach in the oval. And who are bounced up there? Boise and the boys. <laughs> How you doing? How the madam? <laughs> but how you could get on so you can introduce the boys? <laughs> she have a will. <laughs> but thank God the cricket so hot that them fellas didn't have time to take me on. So we settled down to watch the match. Tension in the oval. Combined islands batting, Trinidad bowling. Islands have runs to make, Trinidad have wickets to take. Tension in the place like steel. If islands win, they get the shield. I settled down to watch the match. And it's then Tanti Moyle start. <laughs> she touched up by John in front she. <laughs> and tell he to take off his hat. <laughs> she say it barring her. Well, you know what happened next. He start to cuss she, and she start to cuss he, and I trying to put peace. But I frightened because the real bad John she interfere with. Lucky for them, just then Richards get out, because they say the ball follow the bowler hand and hit the wicket, and Richards out the crease, so Richards out. So Tanti Merle forget the bad John and she start with the umpire. <laughs> she say what she wouldn't do and what she would do to he if she ever get out there on the field. But just then Alan start to play ball and the score start to move and the crowd start to roar and Tanti Merle sat along. That's my boys and them. Next thing you hear, braps, chilling for out. Braps, Eddie out. Braps, Corey out. Empty as and Jumadin spinning ball like smoke and the crowd cheering them too. Tanti get vexed. <laughs> she say the crowd too hypocrite. <laughs> it's how they cheering for one body and back in the next body. So it's mass in the oval again. Next thing you know, Tanti Mall decide she want to change seat. She say how she can't see from where she's sitting down. And she turn around and tell a man, on top of all that, how empty as stoning. <laughs> so he turn around and tell she, that spinner can't stone. And ask she where she come from. <laughs> well, who tell he say that? <laughs> we get the whole history of St. Vincent again. But this time, she stand up on the seat. <laughs> so I beg she, Dudu darling, please open the basket. Share out the food. So she opened the basket, and share out food, but it was like Christmas. If you see food, she even gave the bad John peace. <laughs> but next thing you know, Alan Vop and Gekiach Yout at 96. Mass in the oval. Roberts and Finley batting. 13 runs needed. Tanti Mull says she going down front. She had to go down front. So Tanti in front, I behind. Roberts whoop hit six. Gomes catch him. Roberts out. Tanti get vexed. She start with Gomes now. She said the way Gomes jump and catch that ball, he must be eat mountain chicken from Dominica. 
and she start up saying how the tea thing. But then the match go. Nine balls to go. Seven runs needed. One wicket to fall. Go come into bat. And Finley at the other end. And it's then the action start. Oval. Noise. Excitement. Nine balls, seven runs to go. Noise in the oval. Eight balls, six runs to go. Tanti waving the basket now. <laughs> seven runs, seven balls, five runs to go. Tanti waving the parasol. Six balls, six runs to go. Tanti on top the seat. Five balls, five runs to go. Police cautioning Tanti. Four balls, four runs to go. I can't even see Tanti now. Three balls, three runs to go. Tanti climbing over the fence. Two balls, three runs to go. Tanti on the people field. One ball, three runs to go. The man hit the ball, pelt down the wicket. One, two runs, score tie, 283. People say the island win. Well, next thing I see is Tanti in the middle of the field. She and one set of people from the small island jumping up. And all I could see is the parasol up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Next thing, loudspeakers say, match and tie, match draw. Well, who tell them say that? <laughs> Tanti Merle start up. She said a thief. She said change the rules. She said tie and win, same thing. She said she forming delegation to go to the prime minister. And she climb up on the thing that just roll the pitch with. <laughs> that same Tanti Merle who you say butter can't melt in she mouth. That same Tanti Molly took me two hours to get her out of the oval. She nearly caused riot. The basket wash up. We lose the parasol. And she talked from the oval straight on to QEP. And you know when we reach the gap, what Tanti Mole have the heart to ask me? When next we going back? <laughs> 